tutorial on how to make a crocheted granny square. I'm using double knit wool and a size 5 crochet hook. So I'm going to start by making a slip stitch, a slip knot even, slip knot and chaining four. One, two, three, four. And I'm going to slip stitch to the first chain to form a small ring, like that. And then into the center of the ring, I'm going to do 12 double crochet. I chain one to start, and then I'm going to do 12 double crochet using American terminology. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I'm going to slip stitch to the top of the first double crochet and so your first round will look like this. Now for my second round I'm going to chain one and I'm going to do two double crochet into the same space as the chain one so that would be right there. One, two, I'm then going to chain three. And this is going to be my first corner of my granny square. And into the same space as the two double crochet, I'm going to do another two double crochet. One, two. And it might not look like it, but that's your first corner. I am then going to chain one and I'm going to skip across two double crochet and into the third double crochet across I'm going to do two double crochet one two for my second corner I'm going to chain three one two three and I'm going to do two double crochet back into the same space one, two, and so now you have two corners. I'm then going to chain one and I'm going to skip across two, two double crochets and into the third double crochet I'm going to do two double crochet three chain and two double crochet all into the same space. One, two, and that's your third corner done. I am then going to chain one. I'm going to skip two and into the third chain, third double crochet here. I'm going to do the same again, two double crochet, three chain, two double crochet, all into the same space. Two double crochet, one, two, three, chain, two double crochet, one, two, I'm going to chain one and I'm going to slip stitch into the top of the very first double crochet of this round. And that is the second round of your granny square. Now I'm going to slip stitch across to the first corner. So I'm just going to slip stitch through these stitches. I'm going to chain one and I'm going to do exactly the same thing again. So two double crochet, three chain, 
and two double crochet all in to the same corner, the same space. And you now have your first corner of your third round. So after you've done that, you chain one and into the space in the middle, you do two double crochet. Two double crochet. You then chain one and into the second corner, you're going to repeat the pattern of two double crochet, three chain and two double crochet. three chain and two double crochet one two again chain one the chain one is to go across the double crochets and into the center do two double crochets chain one and into your third and into your third corner, you're going to repeat the pattern again. Two double crochet, three chain, two double crochet. And you always do one chain across to the next gap. And in the middle, I'm going to do two double crochet You can always do three if you wish, but I just do two. And into the fourth corner of your third round, two double crochet, chain three, and two double crochet, chain one, and into your last gap of this round, two double crochet. Of course, I'm using American terminology. And one chain, and you're going to slip stitch into the top of the very first double crochet of that round. And you now are on to your fourth round. And it basically, you're just repeating the pattern the whole way around. So I'm just gonna start the beginning of this one to show you. And again, what I do is I slip stitch to the first corner and I repeat the same pattern. Chain one, two double crochet, chain three, two double crochet, chain one, and on this round you're gonna have two gaps. So you chain one between each gap and you do two double crochet into each gap. So I've chained one, I'm going to do two double crochet, oops, into the first gap, I'm going to chain one, I'm going to do two double crochet into the next gap, chain one, and I'm on to my second corner, which I do two double crochet, three chain, two double crochet, and you just keep going round and round. And of course, on the next, uh, the next round, you would have three gaps, and so on. And so, I'll just come to the end and I'll show you what it looks like at the end. And I've come to my very last chain. I'm going to chain one and into my very first corner and my very first double crochet I'm going to slip stitch like so and I always chain one and when I cut the thread when I pull it through I pull the thread tight like that. And that is what a granny square will look like when you're finished. Of course, you can keep going round and round and make a huge blanket or you can make lots of little squares and sew them together.